One month from now, the government will begin offering booster shots for those whose COVID vaccine effectiveness may have waned, but maybe yours hasn't. Is there a way to find out if your antibodies are still robust? This woman is about to find out what we all want to know. Does her COVID vaccine still work? So doctor, are my results in for my antibody test? Catherine Coughlin, wife of Inside Edition's LA bureau chief, was vaccinated six months ago. But with new data showing the Pfizer vaccine waning over time, she's eager to find out, is she still protected? Catherine stopped by Dr. Andrew Schroeder's office for an antibody test. One day later, the results are in. Our lab measures them from zero to 10, and after that, it's off the scale. Okay. And it turns out your antibodies are off the scale. They are unmeasurably high. That's amazing. That's so good to know that it's still working and I can relax a little bit. But some doctors caution antibody tests may not be a reliable indicator of immunity to COVID-19. These tests are not FDA approved. They're not standardized and there is still not any agreement about how much antibody will actually protect you. I am vaccinated and I got COVID and it's bad. Actress Melissa Joan Hart, TV Sabrina the Teenage Witch, is the latest high profile breakthrough case. In an emotional Instagram video, she revealed that she and her son just got sick. I just really hope my husband and the other ones don't get it because if someone has to be taken to the hospital, I can't go with them. The mom of three believes one of her sons brought the virus home from school. I'm really mad that my kids didn't have to wear masks at school. Because I'm pretty sure that's where this came from. The debate over masks in schools rages on. A school board meeting in Louisiana was shut down by anti-mask protesters, as across the nation, school districts grapple with how to keep kids safe. The number of children hospitalized with COVID, now at its highest point since the pandemic began. 